Red light. Oh, it's green. Green Well, hey fans, welcome back to another episode of Movie Date, and happy Valentine's Day. I said we'd be back in 2022, and here we are, finally going on another date. All of the major holidays are past us, and for today's uh, movie date, we are going to see Death on the Nile, and I have been very much excited for this movie since the last movie came out, uh, Murder on the Orient Express, stars Kenneth Branagh, who also directed it, by the way, and I just can't wait to see how Hercule Poirot like solves this mystery. I, I I hope it's good. I enjoyed the last one, so not sure what to expect from this one with the different cast accompanying him, but I think it'll be good. Mm -hmm. And for the restaurant today, for the date portion of the movie date, we are going to Zach's Famous Frozen Yogurt. That was a big bump, uh, but yes, Actually, we are. It was a bottle. It was <laughs> Hot, you're right, uh, hot hole. Uh, but Zach's Famous Frozen Yogurt, yeah, I, uh, well, I think the title of the restaurant speaks for itself. They have Famous Frozen Yogurt, and I hope it's good. Uh, my wife uh, has owed me a sweet treat lately. I uh, forget exactly what I did to earn it, but we were supposed to get some the other day, and sadly that did not happen, but tonight, She's making up for it, and I am getting that yogurt. So, yes, excited. And of course, no movie date is complete without the candy, and today's candy is... Starburst. Starburst, share something juicy. Do you remember when they had those commercials where people would fold things with their tongue, and the guy would pull out like a little paper crane from yes, the Starburst? Yes, I do remember that, actually. So I guess the thing was that you could unwrap it with your tongue. Yes, I can actually unwrap can the Starburst you? with my tongue. Yes, it is not. Once you get the first little flag up, once you get like enough slide on it, and that one piece comes up, the rest you just get it in between your teeth, and yeah, you can pull the wrapper clean out of your mouth. I might try it later. We'll see. At least it'll be dark in the theater. <laughs> Looks like the inside is currently closed and you have to go through the drive-thru, so we will go through the drive-thru. So we're sitting here waiting in the drive-thru. They have a wide variety of things and I'm trying to decide if I want to be boring or get something new and exciting. So, so many options. My wife is currently updating her Google Maps. No, I'm not. I'm looking at the menu. No, she's not. She's looking at the menu online. Because I think I know everything. So, there you go. I do not know everything. We have cups, cones, banana splits, sundaes. We make our own waffle cones. We have a bunch of different. And we always keep chocolate, vanilla, strawberry, and cheesecake and sugar-free vanilla. And then we have three other flavors we always rotate through a lot of different ones. Huh. So if you just go to um, Zach's Famous Frozen Yogurt and friend us, mm -hmm. we have the current flavors on there, and then we can make whatever you want, like Burger King. Gotcha. <laughs> Will do. All of our yogurts are no fat, no cholesterol with the active agriculture, so they're uh -huh. as healthy as any. And we have two that's no sugar, sweetness, Splenda for diabetics as good as the other, but only one calorie per ounce difference in calories, 21 or 22. So besides the yogurts, we have smoothies and Hawaiian shaved ice and frozen pop. All right. So. Cool. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, ladies. Thank you, ladies. Nice to meet you, guys. Nice, nice to meet you, too. Bye-bye. Bye. So here we go. I am so excited. Oh, it looks so good. So now that we are parked, you can see exactly what we got here. I got the hot fudge sundae with caramel and peanuts, whipped cream and a cherry on top. Mm. And I got French vanilla cup with some strawberries. So. Mm, that's good. 
Hmm. We'll be back. All right, we are walking into the theater now, and as always, we'll let you know what we think when we come out. Two hours later. So we are leaving the theater now. Overall, I, I thought it was a fun date, but starting with the date part, the food. Zach's famous frozen yogurt, thumbs up for me. My Sunday was delicious. I want another one. So good. I cannot wait to go there again. I'd also give it a thumbs up. Um, I do think that the strawberry of mine was nice. It was, you could tell it was frozen, but it didn't have a lot of syrup to it. So it wasn't too sweet. It gave a little bit of something to have with the yogurt. Um, and of course, vanilla frozen yogurt's great. So yeah. Thumbs up. For the movie, I enjoyed it. I think I enjoyed it as much as the first one. After a while, you kind of start piecing together who did it in your head. And I was pretty much right, but like I said, I enjoyed it. The acting was fine. We get a nice origin story for how Hercule Poirot got his mustache, which it was a little out of place, but it was interesting to see. Uh, they used a little bit of de-aging technology on uh, Kenneth Branagh. Overall, in terms of a score, I think I'm going to give it probably a 7 out of 10. Very, it's, it's a decent film. I agree. I'm also thinking a 7. I think it was enjoyable, but maybe dragged on a little long. Um, acting was decent. I agree. And overall, I just enjoyed it. So. And for the candy, well, Starburst. Uh, I love me some Starburst. I really enjoyed the pink ones. Red's not my favorite, but... Thumbs up. I mean, it's Starburst. What, what can you say? Definitely a thumbs up for Starburst, but Starburst isn't really one that hits the spot when I'm wanting candy. So maybe more of a, an angled thumb. You know, it's good, but it's just not my choice. Understood. So. Well, we'd like to thank you guys for joining us on this episode of Movie Date. Uh, remember, you can read the full review for death on the nile on the website flipfrogllc.com slash flixfrog you can find us on facebook instagram twitter and reddit and please pretty please remember to like share and subscribe subscribe to the youtube channel the facebook page the website any and everything with flipfrog flixfrog flipfrog books make sure you hit that subscribe button and until next time we'll be seeing you